Welcome to a fall tradition. It's definitely a fall classic. It's vintage fall brawl right here on WWE 2K14. I'll also be doing WWE 2K15 gameplay commentaries, live commentaries over every single match. This is what I think the current uh, edition of WCW fall brawl would look like. It's going to be a first blood match. Triple H versus CM Punk. The first superstar to make the other bleed simply is going to win this match. This match has been a long time coming for CM Punk, the cult of personality. It's all about retaliation. It's all about retribution. It is all about revenge for CM Punk tonight. And so far here at Fall Brawl, he is getting just that. And if you want these videos to continue, make sure to leave your comments, leave your opinion, subscribe, and of course, like the video and show support for this channel as CM Punk is in full control of Triple H as this match starts. Yes, CM Punk like a, a head of steam. CM Punk all over Triple H. GTS! CM Punk with a GTS on Triple H. So soon, so early. And there it is! The knockout blow! GTS on Triple H. Fall brawl. One, two, three. No, I want to fall. Oh, what a... Oh, how close. Oh, that was very, very close. That was so close that Triple H all moments could taste defeat right there. But Triple H coming back out. And, oh, what a close line to CM Punk. Remember, if you want this pay-per-view to continue, like this video and subscribe. Now, a few days ago... I did November to Remember. That was an ECW classic pay-per-view. Now I'm bringing back a classic WCW pay-per-view. Remember, for more videos like this, you must like the video, subscribe, and leave a comment. It is very crucial that you do that if you want me to keep doing these kind of pay-per-view outings. And right now, what an outing it is with Triple H and CM Punk. Such a pass, such a storied rivalry. This match was originally supposed to take place at WrestleMania, but it did not happen. It did not go down that way. Triple H faced Daniel Bryan at the November to remember that I had right here on this channel. Triple H now having his way with CM Punk, sending CM Punk off into the far side. Oh, Punk right into it, and Triple H takes down the knee. Uh-oh, when Triple H starts working over that knee, any, anyone knows that Triple H is very cerebral, and he always is, is always thinking ahead. He's always one move ahead. He's always thinking. That's why he's such a strategist in that ring. Not only inside the ring, but outside the ring as well. And now he's just picking apart and taking apart CM Punk. But Punk answers with a reversal. And, oh, what double knees to the face. CM Punk with double knees to the face of Triple H. CM Punk, let's see what he can do with Triple H. And, oh, but Triple H, just like that, reverses the momentum. Uh, just when you thought CM Punk had something building, Triple H comes right back and has an answer for CM Punk. But I can guarantee him to you, CM Punk isn't the best in the world for nothing. CM Punk is going to battle back. Because he's courageous. He's a fighter. And now look at CM Punk in a submission move. But I don't think CM Punk, no, he ain't going to quit. He ain't going to tap out. And it doesn't matter if he did because it's a first blood match. You must make your opponent bleed. And Triple H is really focusing on the face of CM Punk in this match. Pedigree. There it is. A pedigree at Fall Brawl. There's a cover. One, two. Did I mention that you can also win this match by pinfall? I don't know what's going on here. I think the rules are changing because I'm just receiving word in my ear right now that... This match can now be won by pinfall. Now, wait a minute. The, the rules are being changed. This isn't right for CM Punk. CM Punk went into this match thinking it was a first blood match, not pinfall. And Punk coming back, though. Punk overcoming the odds somehow. CM Punk now. What's he going to do with the game? And uh, But the game, once again, focusing on the head. So now Triple H has two ways to win this match. Yeah, well, going in, we thought it was a pinfall. But now, apparently, it's first blood as well. Well, can you win by submission? Is that going to is that gonna change? Is the direction of this match going to uh, drastically uh, be different now? What's going on here? Well, Triple H is taking every advantage necessary. This is not right. This is not fair. Well, Triple H, you know, he was never, uh, you know, a fair game player. He was always a master of the game, but he was never fair. And now Triple H, once again, now, now wait a minute. Is there going to be submission here? Because now he's got CM Punk in a submission hold again. Don't tell me that he's going to say that you can win by submission as well. We went into this match thinking it was first blood, not pinfall and first blood at the same time. That's why Triple H has taken over drastic control of this match. That's why Triple H is controlling much of this match. Because he has thrown away this match. This match is thrown into disarray. Now H to the top rope. Oh, knocks down CM Punk. What a move that was. Yeah, I mean, when you go into a match thinking that you've got to beat your opponent. And you've got to be better than your other opponent. And then, then you told, well, no, it's a, it's actually a first blood match. Well, no, it's actually pinfall too. It really, and wait, Punk reverses it. CM Punk with a DDT. CM Punk with a blockbuster maneuver. Let's see what Punk can do now. And oh, but just as CM Punk gets into the groove, Triple H puts an end to it. CM Punk is hitting his best moves, and he did very good in the beginning of this match. Make no mistake about it. But now Triple H is in the driver's seat because of the momentum switch of this contest. What a fall brawl that this is going to be. And if you wanna, you know. 
say what match you want to see. What matches do you all oh, know? Not another pedigree. Oh, this is going to be it. Not another pedigree. Don't do it. Triple H, come on, Triple H. Punk, get out of it. Oh, no. Another pedigree. Another devastating pedigree. Did that make CM Punk bleed? Is he busted open? Is he blooding like a sieve? Is he bleeding like a faucet? Well, not yet. The referee hasn't stopped the match. Triple H, Ingle for Oh, no. Oh, now Triple H is going to go for a weapon. Oh, this is just great. Well, now, of course, it's first blood, so no disqualification. This is ridiculous. The odds that are being stacked against CM Punk in this contest is absolutely ridiculous. It's out of this world. It's you got to be kidding me. Well, I don't think CM Punk is getting the kind of retrib retribution he wished for. And uh, now what's CM Punk going to do with the game? This is, this is not what CM Punk bargained for. And, of course, CM Punk is getting screwed again. CM Punk is probably going to walk out of this company again after this match. I can assure you of that. And, oh, no, right on the concrete floor. A neckbreaker, a swinging neckbreaker on the concrete. The cold concrete floor. And it's sinister and it's dark. And, oh, no, oh, no. I think Punk's bleeding. Oh, no, Triple H has won this contest. Oh, damn it. Good God almighty. This is not going to sit well with CM Punk. This is not good. This is not how CM Punk envisioned Fall Brawl going. Remember, if you want this pay-per-view event to continue, make sure to like this video and subscribe. I cannot believe these turn of events. I cannot believe what Triple H has done. Triple H has fooled us all and he's fooled CM Punk he pulled the rug from underneath CM Punk once again well once again that's why he's called the, the cerebral assassin but remember for this video to continue like the video and subscribe this is only the first of many many matches that you will get tonight at Fall Brawl WWE 2K14 and you'll also be seeing WWE 2K15 I'm just having fun bouncing back and forth with the games here what other matches should happen at Fall Brawl you get to also Come up with your own matches. And if, I, if it seems good enough, it seems good enough. I'll put the match on for you. Subscribe. Triple H buries CM Punk again. Ridiculous.